<laughs> Nike man. <laughs> Depends, but long sleeves any day. Students. When I went to high school, fresh, my school father asked me to go and to go and fetch water. I went to fetch the water. I met this guy and asked me what's my name and I, I said my name. He asked me my school father's name and I said it. And he told me he'll call me clock from now on. Was. I was like, okay. I didn't know why. But that was it. I went to the room and I told my school father that till I meet this guy, I said he'll call me clock. That's it. Clock stuck. And then he started teasing me with they thought they were teasing me, but when I love the name. Charlie Clock with Clock. It'd be a weird name, but Charlie Clock with Clock. Um, society and basketball, it's, it's been a long journey with that because um, growing up you want to have fun with guys, you want to play the basketball they are playing because I feel like I can play and then when you get to the court they be like, um, you be proud, you get hurt so be on the sideline and most of the times you know when you're on the court you want to really partake in the basketball and they want to give you a pass and it's like they are passing the ball to you like <laughs> I challenge then the fear say go ahead <laughs> that feeling be some way but um it's society I, I learned I grew to accept it and I knew there's nothing I can change about it I can change myself and how I accept it so I faced it the way it came to me I mean <laughs> I realized if I don't change my mentality towards facing society Charlie it will always face me the way it faces me so Actually, in the beginning, it wasn't basketball. It wasn't me wanting to be a good basketball player. I wanted to be a, a good sportsman. I started with soccer back in basic school. Um, I really wanted to play the soccer team. Charlie was. I loved soccer. Everybody knew I could play. But anytime you go for practice and they are selecting players, the coach would give me that eye that tells me that. I remember the latter part of basic school, I got the selection. He picked me because I'm consistent. I'm always coming for practice. He knows I'm pushing. I want to play. And he picked me, but he put me in charge of the table tennis team. He made me the captain of the table tennis team. And I didn't know how to play table tennis. I wanted to play soccer. Now I became the captain, like, not just because I was given the captainship, but because I know how to play. When I went to Tesher, um, um, second cycle, then right now, I wanted to do every sport. So, I played volleyball, I played table tennis, I played soccer, I played basketball, anything sports Ghana recognizes, I touched it and I did it, so. <laughs> At the moment, I have graduated um, KNUSD. Um, I finished my national service at the sports directorate and I have started my own brand, Clockwork, that's the hat I'm wearing, Clockwork brand. I make apparels, basketball apparels. Now it's basketball but I will go into sports sooner. So I make t-shirts, um, jerseys, apps, shooting sleeves and all that. Thankfully it's growing bit by bit, it's getting recognized. So most of the jerseys you see around, like Legon Presec, Legon University of Ghana, KNUST, the t-shirts and everything is from Clockwork. So yeah, that is what I'm doing now. And there's, there's sports that actually has kind of contracted me to be an assistant coach to the basketball team. So I am assisting the main coach to coach the basketball team, which is also what I love. So yeah, getting tips. So yeah. My biggest challenge has been to fit in in a strong team and I had this challenge um, with shooting because of how short my right leg is when I'm squaring to shoot is hard because then I have to make the right leg come up before I go up and I couldn't shoot that well because Charlie it's a challenge you need to shoot for score so I'm not going to shoot the ball so I shoot I'm not going to score yeah and I met this amazing coach coach Oklu Charlie turn my life around Go to Action Chapel International around 12 o'clock. It's time to be squatching, and you'll be sitting drinking ice cream, and I'll be shooting. I'll be crying. It's time to shoot, shoot the ball, and I'll still be shooting. I'll be missing, shooting the whole time. Right now, I think I'm I'm one of the good shooters in Ghana. I feel I am because when I shoot, I score at least. So yeah, sometimes I forget I limp <laughs> because Charlie. 
Tell it's been hard and I've worked hard to get here, so... so don't hide it. When I, 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 I remind myself that, or something reminds me that this is who I am, this is how I look like, I still don't care. Because I've really, 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 really worked hard. I win twice. Which be record, nobody will report twice. Yeah, I win twice. I go finals five times. I go finals five, five times. Yeah. Twice. I win MVP twice. Yeah. Need to hear that. Need to hear that.